Chandler Vardron's game isn't the norm for most point guards. The senior stands at 6'7", isn't the most athletic, but finds a way to affect the game in so many ways. He's currently the nation's active leader in triple doubles and has a unique way of describing his playing style. For someone who's never seen me play, it's a little bit different than most point guards. They're usually, you know, like Russ, small and fast and can kind of do different things like that. I'm a taller point guard. I was 5'10 when I was a freshman in high school and then by my junior year I was 6'5 and now I'm 6'7. So my game has always been evolving, but I always kept my point guard type skills. Just trying to affect the game in as many ways as I can, whether it's rebounding, scoring or passing. I'm just trying to do whatever the team needs in order for us to win that game. I mean, to become a good passer, I think to a certain extent it's a feel and it's kind of, you know, God-given. I think you can get better at it, but I think there's just some things in a basketball game that you can't teach. Just my IQ and my feel for the game, I think, is what makes it really easy. I feel like I see passes before they happen and I can kind of make that pass to the spot before the guy knows it's coming. A lot of people ask me about the triple-double thing and whether or not I'm aware of it. Truthfully, I'm just playing throughout the game. I'm just trying to affect the game as much as I can. For me, like, I kind of gauge how hard I'm playing and if I'm going hard enough on my rebounds. So if I feel like I'm really rebounding the ball and I'm going hard, I feel like I'm playing hard. And then the scoring and the, and the assists will happen as they do, but I'm just lucky enough that, you know, God gave me the ability to affect the game and I'm six seven and you can't grow any taller you know so i'm just happy with what i have and i try and use my skills to the best of my abilities i think i'm a different player from four or five years ago in, in a lot of different ways i think my maturity has come a long way i thought before i was you know a player who kind of thought i deserved more at my d2 and was a little upset that i didn't go d1 so my coachability wasn't as high as it should have been and when i got here i think they really you know humbled me and it made me understand, you know, there's a lot for me to learn. So that's one thing. And then two, my game just evolving with my shot, um, getting bigger, stronger, faster. I think if I played myself four years ago, I'd, you know, give my, my old self a lot of problems.